Hello humans. So we've got a treat for you today. We've been invited this year by World Design Weeks, the World Design Weeks organization. You can go to their website worlddesignweeks.org and you can check out a lot of the design weeks happening across the world including Lima Design Week which is happening in November. That's the next one. So under the banner World Design Weeks United we've been invited to participate in Dutch Design Week. So they're doing a virtual festival this year with 3D viewing rooms, 360 videos etc. So if you're missing it this is the chance to see it. We've been given a space to create a 3D viewing room as you can see here with different options for the shape and for the color even the fog thickness and to add audio here as well so there are there are different 3D viewing rooms IKEA did one Mini did one a lot of graduate designers have done one as well really cool we've created a tour featuring work by all these people who took part in Nairobi Design Week in two projects that really coexist together. The Labeled Human and Paint the Court. Paint the Court is an open source creative toolkit for communities. And Labeled Human is a campaign that brings humanity together through our similarities and differences and by sharing what we've all been labeled. You can see the credits here. And we've embedded a couple of videos onto the Africa Design Podcast episode of the Urban Residency with, with the designers who created these basketball hoops, so far here, you can see this photo by Lyra Alpha, amazing photo, shout out to Lyra, and the music video that was created during Nairobi Design Week. There's also other designers, Kashyap, who designed the bollard lights, the Umoja light, so you can see a time lapse here of, of the light at the venue, 209 State House Road. And then if you go into Start Virtual Tour, that's when you go into the 3D, 3D like space. So let's jump into our experience here. You can see it's shaped like the three throw line on a basketball court. Use your keyboard to navigate around. Paint the Court is Nairobi Design Week's first case study to showcase how design can bring together communities with a focus on resource and sustainability, impact and heritage, and interaction and relevance. Issues faced by events and festivals. And then we move on to the next part. You can see the video embedded. Those labels are free, but labels ain't deep enough to be who you be. So ataka waitika majina wana ita. You don't need the label to be, we're all human. Shout out to Gala, everyone else as well who took part in this, really, it was incredible. So we had design workshops and an exhibition. Design thinking workshops were held with skaters and with storytellers. An exhibition invited temporary exhibitors as well as permanent exhibitors, those who created something that would leave a legacy at the venue long after the project is complete. We've got the engineering, the urban residency. The Urban Residency was an open call with Kenya Lighting Industries, which invited designers to create basketball hoops, seats, and lighting. The basketball court was restored and resurfaced, and an access ramp was added to it. Close up here of the basketball hoops, and here you can find the link to the Urban Residency on our website. Another close up here of Kashyap's Omoja Lights. So these have the Nairobi Design Week pattern, but they come with different patterns. Now the artists, this was really a centre point. A shout out to all the artists, Afro Renaissance Collective, Chela, thank you for leading this, this whole exercise. Quote me, Mushira, Ernest, everyone who came from the public, and Swift as well for creating that dope mural just by the entrance. Really amazing, thank you. As well as exhibiting, artists were invited to lead the way in mural painting and participants in the printmaking workshops got to keep a t-shirt that they made. As well as skateboarders and roller skaters, Beyond Hoops Africa brought in ballers to test run the new court and planned an exhibition event which invited local teams to play each other. And then let's go on. Now you've got Antoinette, one of the dancers in the Labour Human music video. And you can see the, the mural closer here as well. So you can see designers for everyone, 
I was labelled and all these different labels here on the mural. This is just so, so dope. And then Chela's, Chela's style here as well throughout. And you can see the design thinking workshops in front of another part of the mural as well, as well here. This is Mush, Mush Morags. And if you want to check out more about the label team and music video, find the song lyrics, etc., you can go to nairobidesignweek.com. Shout out to all the festival partners. Here they are as well. Thank you all. An embedded screen capture from our website for those who, who haven't been there, inviting them to go. And then the Africa Design podcast, Africa with a K dot design. And here's a, here's a fragment from the last episode. First of all, pay attention to what you're really excited about. When, when you show up as a designer, always have, try and have as much fun as possible. To find people with different skills that you can collaborate with Without humility, then you will not really understand greatness. Yo, yo, yo. Yo. You can check out more at africa.design or search for Africa with a K, design. Thank you, that's it.